Hey, what's going on, y'all? Okay, so we are going to be taking a trip down to Crystal River, Florida. Um, it is um, going to be towards the end of February, and um, I kind of wanted to go over with some of the lures that I picked up. I figured anybody that lives down there or who has visited there that watches these videos could kind of give me a couple pointers maybe, but um, I'm going to get right into it here and show you what I got based on some of the research that I've done. All right, so first of all, I got some new GoPro batteries. I'm trying these ones out. They're um, made by Watson. Um, I got them on B&H Photo, and I think they were like, I wanna say they were like thir 13 bucks a piece. They, were, they weren't that expensive a piece. They were pretty cheap, but it's the company is Watson, and they are supposed to be a direct replacement for the GoPro batteries. Um, they look exactly like the GoPro batteries, so I picked up five of those, so we are not going to run out of batteries while we're down there. <laughs> I'll, I'll have a charger with me and stuff, but still. Okay, so for, let's start with the minnow style bait that I got. Alright, so I picked up this Rapala. Um, it's a um, bunker color X-Wrap. So I think it's a suspending too, so if I want to pause it, I can pause it, but it's a suspending X wrap. I think that is going to get crushed, I think. The water's kind of clear down there, and that's a really good color for clear water. This is all, I based all this on like clear water. Um, the next that I'm really excited about, and I think I'm going to try these with bass too, but I got um, the Storm Largo Shads and those are in the um, pearl, French pearl color. Those are the four inch swim baits and I have these jig heads that I think are gonna work really, really nice with those in case I can do some jetty fishing. Um, I got these ones and then I can actually Texas rig those if I want. But they, um, those are gonna be awesome. They have the big eyes too, which I guess works really well down there so that the fish know which end to eat it from. Um, the other jig heads I got were these Fathom Inshore. I thought these looked so cool. Check those out. So these, um, I'm gonna pair these, one of the eyes is already off, I didn't notice that. Oh well. I'm gonna pair these up with these right here. The, I got the Z-Man Diesel Minnows. And those are going, those are the Houdini color. They're, it's like a copper, but it's like a natural on the bottom, copper on the top color. So if I show you from the back, it'd be easier to see. See those? Really, really cool. I'm excited about those paired up with this. I think that the head of that's gonna butt up really nice and it's gonna look awesome. Um, the other uh, Z-Man that I got were the scented, the jerk shads, and those are in the um, new penny color. Again, I tried to keep everything like new penny, root beer, kind of natural colored. Um, except for that, that's the bunker color. Um, those are going to go also on these jig heads. And I have other jig heads too that I'm going to use. Um, let's see. These, um, y'all have seen me use these here. These work. I mean, they're amazing. It's by Egret Baits. It's the Mambo Mullet. That gets crushed. The action on that is awesome. The durability is awesome. These absolutely get crushed. I'm excited about these. These and I'm gonna, um, I still have the Voodoo Vixens. I'm gonna throw some of the Voodoo Vixens. I have some of those in that white color that's more like this. So I think those are gonna get crushed too. I'm hoping to find a jetty and fish around. Okay, so I'm really excited about this. I hope the top water bite is on. Look at that. Really, really excited about this. This, I can use salt water, fresh water, doesn't matter. I can use this for everything, but it is the bone color, but it's got a holographic, um, like, silver finish to it. It's called bone, bone silver. Yeah. And it's a one knocker. That I'm going to be using for uh, bass, too. It's got the salt water hooks on it, but I'm going to be throwing this for bass as well. Really, really excited about this. I hope the top water bite is on. I hope the top water bite is on. We'll see. That's like anything else. You always hope that they're hitting on top water, but you never know. But in case they aren't hitting on top water, I think I have plenty of other options to throw. 
But I'm going down there, and hopefully I can catch a uh, red drum. I want to catch a Florida red drum. We're going on – so the Crystal River is on the golf side. So hopefully um, I get to catch red drum, hopefully snook. Snook would be really cool. I've never caught a snook before, and they don't come up this far. Um, maybe a little tarpon wouldn't be out of the question. I wouldn't mind catching a tarpon. I don't know if they're a mangrove snapper over that far, but uh, we'll see. But, um, yeah, I'm excited about it, and we're going to go down there, and hopefully I can get in some really good fishing while we're down there. We're going to um, a place where the manatees come up in the springs and stuff, and um, hopefully get to film some of that for you all, too. But, anyway, I appreciate you watching the video. Make sure that you hit the like button down below. Um, subscribe that's that's a big thing subscribe share the video out and um, hit the thumbs up button all that good stuff but I will catch you on next time take care